today we are going to discuss about a topic no which we do it daily but don't discuss it in public which is better indian toilet or western toilet hi friends i am dr karamat this is scientific doctor channel in this channel health nutrition and medicine related topics are discussed via very small and simple videos if you want to see such videos kindly subscribe to this channel also press the bell icon and listen to it to get instant notifications whenever i release new content this week's video is about indian toilet versus western toilet i'm not going to speak about engineering aspects construction aspects not those aspects but regarding health and wellness related what is indian toilet where people squat and pass stools okay so you can see in these photographs it is widely used in countries in asia africa no middle east in many countries but western toilets are taking over indian toilet is also called as turkish toilet no by many names basically here you adopt a position of squatting so what this does is this helps in complete emptying of rectum because of the puborectalis this is a muscle because of this puborectalis sling mechanism you are able to completely empty the rectum thereby it helps in preventing constipation also in relieving constipation in those who have it also the contact with the toilet is very minimal only your foot is in contact with the toilet seat otherwise the no other body parts come into contact thereby so it is lesser chance of cross infection and hygienically it is slightly better but practically you require acrobatic skills so western toilets in a way are more comfortable especially to the elderly people who often have knee joint problems orthopedic problems arthritis problems and in persons with physical handicap or in persons affected by stroke or in heavily pregnant women so western toilet is comfortable because this toilet we adopt a sitting posture so this is much more comfortable especially for these populations also there is a small element of risk when you squat because in elderly people with hypertension strokes more often happen during squatting position especially associated with straining during defecation so this squatting position precipitates strokes in vulnerable individuals so you have said this is the problem with indian toilet this is the problem with western toilet so what should i do we have to understand we should adopt a method which is convenient for the majority of people who are using that and there is always work arounds for the remaining people so what is that if you have elderly population or you no know, persons with disabilities or persons with stroke any of these persons it is better that you adopt a western toilet but if there is a person with constipation or if you are worried about you no know, having constipation you can have a toilet stool so that you bend your knees better and you can relieve the you no know, rectum completely similarly if you are worried about the hygiene aspect always keep your toilet seat the rim of the toilet seat clean and dry thereby preventing cross infection so the best way probably is to have a western toilet if you no know, you have a persons with constipation they can use a toilet stool and always maintain personal hygiene we can't just simply say no that old technology was good no that old is good is concept is no old is gold concept is coming back and every people think no no indian toilet is better no basically we have to understand that there is a reason for adopting these things and when you think about as a whole family you no know, the persons who are all using it we need to consider all of their demands and western toilet by itself is not bad if you make certain changes to that it should also be good if you found this video useful consider sharing among your friends and relatives if you want to see such videos subscribe to this channel till we meet again bye